Hey guys, OJ Williams here. We are at the New York City premiere of Top Gun Maverick. We're on the red carpet interviewing all the stars. Stay tuned. JJ, congratulations. Thank you, brother. Um, last time we chatted, Insecure yeah. Season 1 premiere, yeah. a lot has changed. In Brooklyn. In Brooklyn. It's crazy. A lot has changed. A lot more offers coming through. Yeah. Tell me how's life been since? Uh, life has been amazing, man. I got to be a part of one of the most iconic TV shows of all time um, and work with people that I absolutely love and and like value and want in my life forever and I got to play a character that was you know loved and hated at the same time but I think people came around in the end and, and, and yeah I think people came around in the end and then you know I got a chance to step into Top Gun which is this legacy that's been 36 years in the making and and got a chance to work with Tom and you know try try a whole new skill set that I haven't really got to use before and uh I don't know, man. I'm just enjoying it all. Like, this is just, it's amazing to be on this ride. It's amazing to do it with people you, like, truly love and who want nothing but the best for you, and you want nothing but the best for them. So Community. it's just fun. Community, yeah. Um, for those who, fans who haven't seen the first one, what do you think they'll take away from this watch, the second one, having not seen the first one? Yeah, you know, I think uh, this film is really about teamwork. It's about competition, right? You're, you're bringing a group of aviators together who had never met before, but they are all the best of the best. And all of a sudden, they're being told they have to work together. And that's not their normal thing. That's not what they normally do. And so what you really start to see is uh, these folks come together and form a team because they realize that, like, you know, teamwork makes the dream work, right? Like, no, they start to realize that, like, the way they're going to get through this is by doing it together as a team. Yeah. I heard you might learn. How to, you might have learned how to fly. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Where, where, where are we going? Yeah. Where, I mean, you trying to ride? Let's go. We can hit the airport right now. I, listen, I'm just gonna tell you. I think I can get us. Up. I haven't flown in a while, but I think I can get us airborne. Okay. And keep us in the air. Landing might be a. We might have to watch like a YouTube tutorial to land. All right. You know. I'm there. <laughs> Congratulations, sir. Thank you, bro. Thank you, man. Hi, congratulations. Thank you. Uh, for younger fans who may not have seen the first one, what do you hope they take away from watching this film? I think it's a very celebratory film. I think it's really fun. It's a big, action-packed blockbuster movie that I think uh, is very immersive, but I think it also has a lot of heart. For someone like you, you've done so many great indie dramas and also big productions like this, what do you love about being a part of a big production like this? just different kinds of things that you're able to uh, you know uh, to capture um, a movie like this for example the flying sequences uh, you need a film of this scale to be able to take something like that on and they're really amazing well congratulations tonight thank, thank you so you. much appreciate it